Hello winners, welcome to where is your USD heading? In this video we're going to talk about your USD, where is it heading, where is it going, what has it done? Of a technical analysis point. So, my name is Ivan Bidl, I'm a forex trader and an economist. And trading forex is risky, not appropriate for everyone. Past performance is not indicative of future results. What has happened in the past doesn't have to have an impact in the future. And also there's risk because there's high reward, high risk in this market. So all of a sudden your, your money can just go away. And also you can be rich overnight if you're lucky. But also that means higher risk. So where are we? And this webinar does not contain any investment advice. So past that, let's go. Technical analysis of EURUSD. Where are we going? Where are we heading? Okay. Easy peasy lemon squeezy. I want you to say this. Okay. Up, down, pullback of the bigger uptrend. Failing to make a new high. Downtrend. That's a downtrend. That's a pullback to the bearish one. Still downtrend. Now it's no longer a downtrend because it didn't make a new low. Now we have an uptrend, uh, a try on a downtrend, but it failed with a continuation of this uptrend, of this overall uptrend moving up. With now, we are in a downtrend with three entries. I got that entry, I got that entry, it got out, and I started buying last week, it did not happen, so... We are still in a downtrend. I thought this was going to go higher because of this uptrend continuation. Okay, fine, fair enough. That's life. This is the sell price for the month. This is the buy price for the month-ish, more or less, given give or take. And then what do we do now? We are reacted off the buy sell price for the month. And then also, so where's the target? Since we now have established it's bearish. One, so I'll make that green. One, I guess also that's also the, some, of, some of the same area. And then this one. Okay. Yeah. This is purely support and resistance. Support, support, support. Only, one and only. And I thought I was support as well, but apparently not. So, what do we do now? Well, I would love it to come back up here to 111, maybe 300, 400-ish. But it doesn't seem like, because we opened out of position this week, meaning, this is to sell, meaning it just went lower. It didn't have much of a pullback, maybe because it's below the monthly buy price, which is now resistance. Okay, fine, I can do that. but. But it would have been higher before we'd love to sell it again. So, sell, sell, sell. Maybe that could happen. Sell again then. Okay. And then where's the ultimate target? TP1 is around... Of, of support and resistance is 106 or 109. Like one... 110.60 and 109.90. Okay, that's where your USD is heading. Trading forex is risky, so don't invest money you can not afford to lose. But if it now makes a new high, it is no longer bearish. Okay, but now it made a new low that is lower than that low and challenging this low. Making a new low is technically a bearish, so I'm not going to buy it anymore. Maybe until February. Hear that? Maybe until February. So, I can wait two weeks. Fine. Until next time, people. Stay safe.